What's going on everyone? Gringo making another video. So, what do we got today? All right. Well, we got a box. What's in the box? What's in the box? Well, let's just, let's take a look at the box. Pretty sweet. See there, there's a skull right there. Kind of give you a hint on what this is. It's kind of a uh, different coin that I just couldn't resist. So, but this is the uh, whoa. <laughs> this this is the uh, certificate of authenticity. This is uh, a Tanzania death head hawk moth. Is what this uh, coin will be which I'll show you here in just a moment. Um, there's a uh, 999 pieces of these, of this particular version. So it's roughly about two ounces. So, but there's uh, the information if anyone wants to read it. So pretty sweet. I like the box. Where's the coin? Well, here's the coin. Look at this giant case. So this is uh this is it. Proof 70 deep cam. Uh, looked on a PCGS population report. As far as I can tell, this is the only one that's ever been sent in for submission. And this is the only uh, Proof 70. So technically it's a one-on-one. So, or a top pop, if you will. So can't complain about that. But I just found that out recently before, uh, before making this video. So I don't know if you can see that coin, but look at that thing. Thing's amazing. I saw this coin, I was like, I don't know what that is, but I want it. And so I got it. I mean, this thing is just massive. But there's the uh, backside of it from Tanzania. Two ounces, this is from 2018. But yeah, I mean, big old case here. But yeah, pretty interesting. It's just got a reeded edge. I don't know if that shows up on camera or not. It's uh, pretty difficult to see in this case, but you might be able to see it like right there. But yeah, it's just reeded edge. But yeah, it's uh, pretty cool. <laughs> it's kind of cool to have one of these giant cases. But uh, yeah, two ounce death head hawk moth. So pretty pumped about this. Like I said, I got this off of eBay. I saw it, I just couldn't resist. But while we're on the uh, subject of strange coins, I got another one, or four. So, I'm sure uh, everyone has seen these before. So these are um, the Australian Shipwreck series, which uh, are pretty cool. So, I got a set of all four of them. And uh, I've never known why, when you read it like this, the ship's upright. But when you read, when you try to actually read the ship, which this one's Bativia, I believe, 1629, then it's upside down. So did a little research on this. It was intended, when you see it like this, the ship's above the waves. But then of course, when you look like this, then you can see it's under the waves. So it's, uh, they put some thought into this. I think there's a mintage of 20,000 per each uh, version of the coin. So. Not super rare, but they're cool. So there's the first one in the series. Here's the uh, second one, which uh, shiny, purdy, if you will. So this one is the uh, Brigold Drakek, I think, 1556. All these ships, uh, from my understanding, I believe wrecked off the uh, ship of Australia. So, um, but yeah. Just a beautiful set of coins. So each one of these is a uh, one ounce of silver. Smooth uh, finish on the edge. So that's kind of different. It's not reeded. So there's the second one. Here's the third one. It's again, just a uh, beautiful coin. I mean, it's up for debate if you want to call these coins or not. It's not in the traditional form, but Per the definition of a coin, it's a coin. So, um, but this one is the Zoot Dorp. 
1712. So pretty cool. And here's the uh, fourth and final one in the set. This one is the Z Week, I believe. So this one's pretty cool as far as uh, seeing it under the waves. This one actually shows it well, I think, in the intended format, if you will. But, I mean, when you look at that, you can definitely envision it under the waves with the tip of the, the hull just peeking through the other side of the waves. But when it's like this, it's uh, definitely on top of the waves. So it's uh, pretty cool. So there's the other side. So pretty cool. Got these off of Instagram. Um couldn't pass up the chance to just own all four at one shot. So that's what I did. So that's it, guys. Look at that thing. It's awesome. I love that coin. So sweet. We will uh, catch you on the next one. So um, bye.